Hey guys, what is up? Honest here from Computing for Life, and today I'm going to show you how to save your picture in onto your desktop. And you guys might be wondering, dude, we already know how to do that. This is really easy. But some people who are starting to learn computers and don't even have a computer and want a computer, <coughs> excuse me, and want a computer, they don't know how to do all this easy stuff. But don't worry, guys. I'll show you. It's really easy. Save the picture onto your desktop. You can either save it as your desktop background or anything you want to do with it. It's really easy. This is probably going to be one of my easiest tutorials, and I will see you guys on the tutorial. Hey guys, I am on my computer and to start off this tutorial, just go to your web browser and in the search bar, type in the picture that you want to search and save on your desktop initially. So let's say I'm, since I like tennis, yeah, since I like tennis, I'm just going to search a, uh, actually no, a cool ten, oh god, I can't type today, cool tennis wallpapers there we go I'm gonna search that you guys can search whatever you want and then click on images and yeah these you can just browse through what picture you want um I think um hmm this one looks pretty sick actually um I'm gonna choose Oh, that one looks pretty sick. And I actually know that player. So, night, guys, this is where the real big deal starts. So, what you want to do, go to the picture that you found, right click, yes, right click on it, and then uh, click on save image. Save image as, right here. Click on that. It's going to bring a new tab. Now, then click on desktop. Click on desktop. And then name it whatever you want. I'm gonna name it. No, I can't type today. Cool tennis wallpaper. And since I know his name, I'm just gonna leave his name down since he's a really good tennis player. Okay, and then once you've done that, and make sure you see this little gray tab on desktop, that you'll make sure you know that it's on desktop. So then just click this big blue button that says save and there you go you have saved it but another way you can also do this is by it's basically the same thing I'm gonna choose a different one this time this one looks pretty sick um, you can also click on it and then follow the process by right clicking selecting save image as clicking on desktop naming it whatever you wanna be I'll just need wait Oh, that's why. Okay. Uh, cool. There we go. And then click on save. And that, you can check on the ongoing downloads by clicking on this little arrow. But you can also do that by going to your desktop. As you guys see, I changed my wallpaper for my desktop background. And there they are. Cool tennis wallpaper. Cool wallpaper. I don't know what that says. But you can just click on it to view it. It'll show you a nice little picture of it. And there you go. Oh, there are your nice pictures. Now, the second part of the tutorial, to change your desktop background. So, what you want to do is select another picture. That, uh, this time, I'm going to select basketball. Whatever you guys want, type in what you want to search. So, basketball, wallpapers, HD. Make sure you have the HD in there. If you don't, then it won't look good. Click Enter, and... Let's see which one looks pretty good. Hmm. Um, I think I'll just choose this one. This one looks pretty amazing. I mean, look at that. That just looks... Oh, 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 oh. Oh, oh, this is not HD. It doesn't have the HD sign over there. Uh, let's see if this one is. Yep, this is HD. You can check, see that by, you can see the HD right there, but it also looks HD. So right click, and then set as desktop background. 
you're gonna see a little picture you can do whatever you want I'll show you what each one looks like center looks like that doesn't look very good title looks like that stretch fill or fit for right now I'm gonna let's see I don't know which one looks the best I think I would say either stretch or either fill I think fill looks better then click on set desktop background and boom bottom shoe look at that amazing stuff amazing amazing so that is it guys that's probably like a second that's, that's like a two part tutorial in one video which is so awesome but that is it guys see it's really simple see really 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 simple so hey guys, if you guys like that video, please like the video and hit subscribe or comment on any more suggestions that you guys want me to do. This will be under uh, easy computer tutorials list on my playlist. Actually, no, I should put it on the same playlist, the basic computer knowledge. So thank you guys for watching, and I will see you guys in my next tutorial, which will be next week, and I will see you guys when I see you.